Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your touchpad settings are missing on your Windows 11 computer. So if for some reason it's not responsive, it's glitching up, it's moving randomly around the screen, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve this without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing I'd recommend doing would be to open up the search menu and search for Control Panel. Best result should come back with Control Panel. Go ahead and open that up. Set your view by to large icons, and then you want to select mouse. So if you have a laptop, there should be a tab that says touchpad over here on the right. You go ahead and left click on that. There should be something under port that should have a device. There should be a button that says enable device again when you go underneath that tab. So I don't have a touchpad on this machine so obviously I cannot show that unfortunately but that's something I would recommend you guys try. A couple other things that we can definitely go through in today's tutorial here. If I close out of here, open up the start menu or the magnifying glass, search for device manager, go ahead and select device manager should be the best match here. Go expand the mice and other pointing devices section and then right click on your mouse and select update driver. Select Browse My Computer for Drivers, and then select, let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer, and then select the specific one for your mouse. If there's only generic ones in here, you can select them. Otherwise, go with the more specific one for your manufacturer, and then select Next. It should say it has successfully updated your drivers. Click on Close. At this point, close out of here, and you can restart your computer and see if that has resolved the problem. A further thing we can attempt here would be to open up the search icon again. Search for Troubleshoot. Best result should come back with Troubleshoot Settings. Go ahead and open that up. Select Other Troubleshooters. Go ahead and left click on that. And then you want to go down underneath Other. And if you're using a Bluetooth mouse, you may want to select Bluetooth. Otherwise, you can go down to Keyboard. Go ahead and click on Run. And if there's any issues, it should detect them here. So pretty straightforward process, guys, on how to do that. If you're still having an issue, you can close out of here. Go also go online to your manufacturer's website or for your computer make and model and see if there are any drivers available for mice or pointing devices. Something else I'd recommend trying. And we can do one further thing here as well. So open up the search icon again. Type in CMD. Best result should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, you want to type in SFC, followed by a space, forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so once that's done, go ahead and close out of here, and you want to go restart your computer.
And there you go, guys. Hopefully, it should be a pretty straightforward process. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.